that's home. That's us. On it, everyone you love, everyone you know, everyone you ever heard of, every human being who ever was, lived out their lives. The aggregate of our joy and suffering, thousands of confident religions, ideologies, and economic doctrines, every hunter and forager, every hero and coward, every creator and destroyer of civilization, every king and peasant, every young couple in love, every mother and father, hopeful child, inventor and explorer, every teacher and leader, every saint and sinner in the history of our species lived there on a mote of dust. Our imagined self-importance, the delusion that we have some privileged position in the universe, are challenged by this point of pale light. Our planet is a lonely speck in the great enveloping cosmic dark. In our obscurity, in all this vastness, there is no hint that help will come from elsewhere to save us from ourselves. The Earth is the only world known so far to harbor life. There is nowhere else, at least in the near future, to which our species could migrate. Visit? Yes. Settle? Not yet. Like it or not, for the moment, the Earth is where we make our stand.
you might wonder why these guys are digging through the trash. Well, it's not just because they love recycling. We live in South Australia and we get 10 cents for every plastic bottle. That might not sound like a huge amount of money, but if you're doing it often, the dollars start to stack up. So some of the money goes towards plants and trees around the school, like some of these. And fingers crossed, next time the money can go towards soccer goals. The 10 cent recycling refund is available to everyone in South Australia in the Northern Territory. All you need to do is collect the kinds of bottles, cans and cartons people carry around and take them to a place like this to cash in. They offer the refund on these containers in particular because they're the ones most likely to end up on the streets as litter. Every year, hundreds of millions of cans and bottles end up in places they shouldn't be. But thanks to the program, South Aussies recycle around 590 million containers a year. That's about 80% of the total number sold in shops, more than double the other states. Recycling stops all this from ending up as landfill. Plus, the materials can be used to make new containers or into something else completely like aeroplane parts, roads, or even this dress for Emma Watson. Now, New South Wales wants to get in on the action too. This is an historical day for New South Wales. Uh, never before has there been an attack on litter like we are undertaking uh, today. But not everyone thinks the plan's a good idea. The drink industry will have to foot the bill for the refund, and that means drink prices will go up to cover it. But environment groups say it's worth spending a little more to help out the environment. So instead of seeing a bit of rubbish on the beach or floating in the creek, you'll see money. The plan's set to kick off in 2017, and if it goes well in New South Wales, we could see other states follow in their footsteps too. That means more people like these guys helping to clean up the environment or making a little bit of money along the way. Well, I like recycling because it helps the earth and like it doesn't pollute it and like not polluting the earth is a better place for us and everyone to live and be happy. <laughs> Thank you.